All right, now that we've gone through and looked at all of our different photos and made adjustments to them all, it's time to select which are the best photos that we want to upload to our listing in Keystone. The best way is to use the star feature of Picasa. The star feature just allows us to, to indicate which pictures in this folder are our favorites. The way, easiest way to do it, for me anyway, is to select the first photo bring it into the into the photo editing view and start to scroll through using our arrows or the uh, arrow keys on your keyboard start to flip through and find the pictures that we've adjusted that we like best this is one that we've edited before and I definitely want to upload that one to Keystone so I'll click down here and click the star you notice a star jumps up on the screen we've now told Picasso that this is one of our favorites so we'll look through and we'll just click through a couple of different photos in here. I like that one. Not so much there. So we'll just look through. That's a good one. Let's start that one before. So we'll just go through, click a bunch of different photographs in our listing. That's a nice one. And we'll add stars. So the star indicator, you notice down here, the star indicator uh, when the star is illuminated, it indicates that there that this is one of our favorites. When we return back to our library, we can see now that that star icon appears on all of the photos that we've marked as our favorites. So, the last thing we want to do is we want to take these favorite photographs, we want to select them, we want to resize them now to a size that will make them quick to upload to Keystone. So we'll go up to the top of our folder, click select starred that will select all of the different starred photos for our listing and then we'll choose file export picture to folder so it's going to ask us where would we like to put these photos just like when it when it did the import feature before it's going to ask us where would we like to to export these full these photos so I'll put them on my preferred place into my pictures directory and we're going to call these uh, Downing Drive for Keystone. So I know which listing these are for, my Downing Drive listing, and that these are the pictures that are for Keystone. The image size options. Uh, for Keystone, we don't want to use the original size. We'd just be uploading these huge pictures that Matrix is going to size down. So we'll tell it to automatically resize each of these pictures to be 800 pixels on its widest side. You see, Picasa has a lot of different choices, so whether or not we want to post them to the web or post them to email. But the size we want to choose for Keystone is the 800 pixels option. The image quality, we'll just leave it normal, and we'll click OK. Picasa will take a few seconds. You'll see a little status bar that scrolls by on your screen. Picasa will take a few seconds, export all of those folders. It'll bring them up on your uh, in your Windows Explorer view, so you see it created a folder for us. With the, full, with the pictures that we selected, the size is now reasonable. And Picasso also creates an exported, full, uh, an exported pictures section of Picasso where we can see all of, the, all of the different exports we've done. So if I click that folder there, we can see that these are the exported folders. So we've seen them now both in the Windows Explorer view and in Picasso. So when we upload to Keystone, these will be the photos that we want to upload for our listing. So now we've seen how to import, adjust, and export our photos so they'll upload quickly and look great in Keystone.